What's up, everybody? It's Merman Mike. I've got my beautiful fiance Natasha with me. Hi. And we're out at Folsom Lake for a change. I haven't been out here in quite some time, and what brings me out here today is someone actually lost their Apple Watch while they were jumping off some rocks over here. So I'm gonna go try to find that for him and uh, basically check out around this whole area. If you can see this boat dock, it's pretty deep off of here. So if someone were to fall, which we actually saw happen when we got here, some poor lady was trying to get her boat onto her trailer and she accidentally took a wrong step and went right over the side. Luckily, she didn't lose anything, but who knows how many other people have done that. And as you guys can see, you can't see the bottom. So if they lose something, it's probably gonna be gone. Also over here, I wanna check out around this tree cause it looks super cool and like there could be some really cool underwater scenery. Plus we saw some fish jump over here as well. So I think it's gonna be a really, really cool day. Anywho, if you guys have never been to my channel before, what I usually do is go out to the local lakes and rivers, try to return any sort of valuables back to their owners. And I always get the trash while I'm down there too because I strongly believe you can't just go for the treasure, you have to get the trash as well. Yeah, without further ado, I'm gonna get down there. If you guys are liking these videos, please remember to like, share, subscribe. Always helps me get back out here, get more valuables back to their owners and get that much more trash out of the lakes and rivers. All right guys, stay tuned. All right guys, so there's the rocks that she jumped off of right there. At least I'm pretty sure those are them from the pictures. We're definitely a, a lot farther out here than we thought we were going to. I'm hoping we'll have enough battery to get back. But hopefully we can find that really fast and uh, who knows how many other people jump off of these rocks. So we're gonna search this one. There's another one right there and we'll search that one as well. I'm super excited. I'm gonna get in the water and see what we can find. All right guys, stay tuned. All right. I think she said she jumped off the rock with a split in it, which is that one. Let's see if we can get lucky and maybe find it right off the shallow here. Oh, darn, it came off right as she hit the water. search that another spot and then uh I wasn't seeing anything down here besides for this. <sighs> I'm so happy about that. <sighs> oh she's got a little like it says NJCU. Oh NICU she's a NICU nurse. Oh NICU. Yeah okay so guys she let me know that she was a nurse and that's why basically she couldn't be here today and she also can't be getting phone calls so I asked her what she got off work, that way I can let her know how the dive went, so later we'll call her on camera and get a reaction. I'm super excited, she's gonna be super stoked. How cute. She said that the Apple Watch was one with a light blue wristband and that's it, so. Oh, and it says NC, what was it? It's a neonatal intensive care unit, NICU. Yeah. And it's got a little stethoscope so, on it. I think it's pretty safe to say that's hers. And uh, let's go on to this next cliff jumping spot really quick. As you guys can see, there wasn't really anything down there, no trash or anything. So it lets me know that it's not really a popular spot. It was probably just somewhere they stopped off, wanted to cool off really quick. But uh, oh, I'm super excited. Let's keep up the good vibes, all right. All right, guys. So this looks like a jumping spot. Let's go search under. <laughs> all right, now let's try. I love you. Sorry. You're all good. Oh. 
second and it was you trying to murder me. No, I <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's plastic bottles over there. I'm gonna search over there. There's definitely been people over there. There's nothing down here. Alright guys, I'm gonna hop up there and grab that trash in just a second. But that is, uh, I mean, a good sign that people have been here, but also like a bad sign that people are lazy and rude. Don't be those people. time to go to the boat dock. Check this out though. It's like half granite, half quartz. Super cool. Uh, can you get over to me? I'm gonna get these plastic bottles. You don't need to be on. Hmm. I guess so here's the watch it is the uh, only thing we found today <laughs> in Folsom Lake at least we're actually gonna do a little bit more searching around the boat dock um, as long as it's not that busy because we don't want it to be in any <laughs> because we don't want to be in anybody's way but check this out it's got a little stethoscope and all that and she's a nurse so this is definitely the right one plus I was fairly positive as soon as we actually found the spot because it was a uh, not easy for us to find But as soon as we found it I was pretty positive it was gonna be right there because usually when you lose something off of a cliff jumping spot It doesn't travel too far, but uh, I'm super excited. She should be super stoked. It's gonna say something tells me uh Yep, look uh, I don't know if you guys can see that on the camera, but the little battery needs to be charged symbol came on so still works perfectly fine She was worried it wasn't going to I don't know if you guys can hear me because of the wind now, but uh yeah, I'm super stoked about this. Let's go see what else we can find today. All right, guys, stay tuned. Hey, look. I think it's a quarter right there. I don't see it. <laughs> All right, guys, first piece of treasure.
You hung the voodoo doll up? Yeah. Are you uh, okay? <laughs> I mean, look at Timmy. He's hanging out on the bike. I mean, that at least looks somewhat natural. You're just hanging her. He's no. growing up so fast. His first bike ride already. <laughs> All right. This room is full of nightmares. All right, guys. So back to the treasure room. We've got the watch right here that we found in the lake, as you can see powered right on up. I just threw it on the charger for about two seconds when I got home because when I actually found it, it gave me the little battery symbol that let me know it still worked. It just needed to be charged. And uh, I'm super stoked. Even if she didn't get a hold of me before I went and found it, she actually had her medical ID in here that had a bunch of phone numbers. So I would have easily been able to get this back to work. Plus there's this nice little customized home screen. Very cute little couple right there. Yeah, I'm super excited. She's a nurse which explains the wristband, if you guys can see it right there, there's a little stethoscope right there, and then it says, what is it? It's NICU. NICU. She's just gonna be super stoked. She does so much good for the world that uh, I'm sure she's gonna like a little bit of good done for her. So yeah, I'm super excited to get to call her and uh, hopefully make her day and have you guys here with me. All right guys, stay tuned. Her name is Danielle, by the way. I'm gonna give her a call right now. Hi, Danielle. Yeah. Hi, this is Mike. I also go by Merman Mike online. We talked earlier yesterday. Oh, yeah. All right. Does this look like it? Oh, my God. That is so awesome. I was going to say, we got the little stethoscope and the NICU on there as well. Yep. That's it. Awesome. Thank you so much. You are very, very I welcome. I send you a donation. Do you have a Venmo or anything? Um, I do, but that is completely up to you. Please don't feel obligated. I very much just like helping people, but um, I can send you my Venmo, but that's yes. completely up to you. Yes, please send it. Thank you so much. And then Thank uh, you. I'll have... I'll be in touch with you tomorrow. Not a problem. Your Apple, Apple Watch right. will be uh, sitting here with the others. <laughs> oh my gosh. I was going to say, you're not the only one. <laughs> Thank you so much. You are very welcome. I hope you have an amazing night. You too. Bye-bye. Bye. All right. I'm super stoked. She was super, super excited. I talked over a little bit just because I always get super excited. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm stoked. I hope you guys are stoked. I'm going to meet her, I guess, tomorrow. She's going to come over after work. I'll get to show her the treasure room, return her watch, have you guys meet her, and uh, just hear a little bit more about how she lost it in the first place. All right, guys. Stay tuned. Hi. Hi, how are you? How are you? Good. This is my beautiful fiance Natasha. Hello. Hi. Mike, nice Hi. to meet you. This is the treasure room. Oh, that's bright. Hi, nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Wow, uh, this is awesome. We have your watch with the uh, plethora of other ones. Oh, thank you so much. You're so welcome. Oh my gosh, look at this stuff, you guys. Oh yeah. I've uh Got quite a collection now. I like to tell people I'm gonna be the coolest guy in orders in about five years. <laughs> <laughs> I literally had tightened it before I jumped, so oh. that's why I was thinking I lost it getting coming back to the boat. No, luckily not, because it dropped off real deep, real fast. Well, thank you so Absolutely. much. Absolutely, thank is, you for coming. This is over. amazing. I was gonna say it's funny because I always love starting this off. I feel like a little mermaid in here, just getting to show all, well, all my you, little trinkets and goodies. That's a lot of work. Yeah, and it's. For me, everything in here is a memory, so it's like oh, a yeah. flood of memories anytime I get to go through here and kind of show somebody stuff. Look at all your fishing lures. <laughs> oh yeah, I've got an entire case there, and then it ran out of space, so they're just everywhere now. Thanks again. Oh, Thank I'm you. Sorry, I'll stop talking. Oh, no. I, I just had a long day. Oh, I, I can understand. Well, thank you so much. It's a pleasure thank to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Drive safe. Thank you. You're very welcome. All right, guys, so. Danielle was super, super stoked to get her watch back. I couldn't be happier to give it back to her. And I'm just, 
I'm thrilled because these are always the videos that make me the happiest of when I can actually return something back to their owner. Obviously it was a little easier on this one because she told me where it was, but uh, not super easy just because it took us about 45 minutes to get out there. Our battery died while we were trying to get out there. We actually ended up buying another battery on the way back so we could do another search that we had planned that day. It was just a whole ordeal, but the, old, <laughs> the actual dive only took like five minutes, but I still could not be happier. Oh, and then when we got back that day, we found a license plate too, that's over here. So this was the other thing we found that day. That was pretty cool. If you're missing your license plate off your trailer, please let me know, I'd love to give it back. Yeah, I had a killer day. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you are enjoying them, please like, share, subscribe. Always helps me make more videos for you guys, get more valuables back to their owners, and get that much more trash out of the lakes and rivers. Anywho, from me and my beautiful fiance, Natasha. Bye. Till next time, everybody. Take care.